Hey guys, Luck here with my 2007 Dodge Charger. I was trying to start it yesterday and it wouldn't start. I tried to give it a jump, it just wasn't enough. I tested the battery and it's time to change it. It's seven years old and it's just dead. So I'm gonna show you quickly how to change the battery. And if you didn't know, the battery for the Dodge Charger is in the, your trunk, not in the front of the car, because it's a big boy battery. So it's right here under your cover. And this is like a tractor size battery. So this one's about seven years old. I had originally changed at the dealership at the 10 year mark or so. So it lasted pretty long, but now it's time to change it. So the way to remove this battery is you gotta remove this bolt right here, which is a 10 millimeter. This bracket holds the battery down so it doesn't shake around. And then you need two 10 millimeter, I mean, you got two 10 millimeter bolts for the actual battery terminals to remove. So we'll do that right now. And then we'll go get a new battery from our zone or whatever. So you kinda need an extension or you're gonna be finding with a wrench down there uh, to remove this bolt. the battery out. There's a little hose here you gotta disconnect to. Remember that so you don't rip anything out. Got a handle. Just pull this guy out. Got the tire coming out here. There we go. Now off to AutoZone to pick up a new one. I forgot to mention, if your car is completely dead, you are going to have to connect jumper cables or a power pack to it to give it enough juice so you can pop open your trunk either with your key fob or with the button in the car. So that's how you open your trunk if it doesn't have the key in it. And if you do have a key, plain and simple. Also, I did push you did the push button start open while the battery in the car so just so you know you don't have to have the battery in it to get the power going got a new battery one with the dura less gold that this thing was uh 210 dollars that's with replacing the old battery and it's the h7 that's what you're looking for for the dutch charger at least 2007 through 10. so yeah let's put it in Popping this back in. Make sure the groove on the bottom sits on top of the battery and slides in there. It didn't give me the knob here, so I'm gonna have to go back and get this so I can connect this hose. But it's not end of the world if you don't have it connected. So let me get our bracket. You can go with this installation kit. Basically, it's a terminal grease and these pads to prevent corrosion. So, we got it. Why not use it? coat each one with the grease the green on the negative the red on the positive now we can get a positive terminal on first Put 
top of it a little bit as well. Okay. Negative. back on at least kind of fits on this one and that should be it guys let's start the car make sure it runs and we are all good and yes we are back to life thanks for watching guys hope this was helpful if you want to see a bunch of other how to videos how to work on this car and other ones Please check my channel out. Please subscribe, follow. Any questions, let me know. Thank you so much.